Grandpa Almond, could you send a few people to check the underground space beneath the tavern? Oh, of course. Uh, may I ask why? The moment I used magic, I sensed something strange down there. I have a feeling it's connected to why the tavern had to close down. Uh, of course. We'll look into it right away. Make sure you listen to Grandpa Omen, Potty Sara. Don't go running off on your own. Potty Sara. Listen. Running! Hey, come back here, you! Wait! Yep, that's Nilo's creation, all right! She's got so much energy. Anyway, how did you manage it, Nilu? Well, all I did was say my wishes for her out loud. Maybe the magic is in the words themselves, just like the book said. This place is seeming more like a fairy tale by the second. I mean, or some are called the Forest of Blessings, so it kind of makes sense. Well, anyway, Paimon thinks this magic suits you perfectly, Nilu. When I brought Hadisara to life just now, I was able to sense the magic flowing through the forest, in the flowers and trees, and inside the creatures that live here. But for some reason, there's a hollowed out space beneath the tavern where I couldn't sense anything at all. We're back, my lady. That was fast. You were right. There was something under the tavern that I've never seen before. It looked transparent and gave off a clinking sound when I knocked on it. Transparent and clinking? Oh, I've got it! Uh, already? <laughs> You've got to use fairy tale logic, Paimon. That's right! An empty ink bottle, to be exact. Still remember the taste of the magic tonic you took a sip of, Paimon? Yeah, it was... ink. <gasps> oh, Paimon gets it now! Traveler, Paimon, will you come gather some ingredients with me? I learned what we need to make the magic tonic back in the Hut of Blessings. Sure thing! What do we need to get? Hmm. A setting sun that never sets, a dragon that cannot fly, and a moon that only shines at night. I... Uh, where are we supposed to find crazy things like that? What? How did you get that so fast? Logic, huh? <laughs> Lucky guess more like. 